Good day, Hi. mates. Poké Dragon here. Hi there on Lightspeed of Lightspeed Reviews, and welcome to the Maple Story animation announcement. Now, this was something to give an idea between Paul and his professor, but his professor lost interest and gave Paul free reign of the project. And I came into it, and I'm one of the voice actors for this project known as Atrike. Um, I'm what I'm I play one of the protagonists. I play Mars Tucker, the team leader of the group of heroes that are in the story. And I play as the wisecrack known as Rex Ray. Also known as the co the comedic relief that winds up in the stupidest of situations despite his luck. You know it. So this story, it's rather fun. Season one's gonna start off. You know oh you know how this is. Season one's always starts off rather fun. But as soon as it gets towards the middle and or the end, it's going to get a little dark. Yeah. But there's going to be some fun, a little bit of romance here and there. For all of you girls who want to be interested in video games and a little bit of romance. <laughs> wink, wink, notch, notch, fairly well. <laughs> um, we, we're basically here to announce some auditions that we basically need. We already have some casting, we already has some casting call, we already have some auditions that we basically made, we already got some female audition roles, but we're looking to cover a few more. Yes, and in addition, we will be providing a link description below to Casting Call Club. This site, basically, you, you just put up a, what your project is and submit what roles that you want for your project, and that's all you really need and so far we've already had the auditions we're going to include our link to the maple story into the description below on both of our channels that's right this announcement video is going up on both of our channels and basically the characters that we have audition are going to be daryl evans who is basically a trikey's father who only cares more about his work than his than his own son and some certain background characters here and there but there is one more, but there is a character that will, there is another, however, another female role that will come into it. Her name is Blitzy Ignis, and there's going to be more filled in on her as soon as we get to episode 5. And there will be a few more characters along the way. Mm-hmm. We'll just announce them, like, one at a time. Yeah, but I will say this one thing about Blitzy. She's very, how should I put it? A little bit... Well, basically, if you know Trixie from MLP, then you'll know Blitzy Igni Ignitus, pretty much. She's a little bit like Trixie, but in terms of attitude, let's just say if you've seen Sunset Shimmer in the first movie, mm, that's how a little standoffish she can be. Pretty much. So, so now this project, it's, it's rather fun. However, once your audition goes up, we will Skype you just pretty much leave like your Skype name. We'll find you on there, and at whatever best time possible, we will audition you. We will do a cast read with you. I'm the voice director of the project, and, and we'll see if your voice is right for the role or not. Um, and I basically just do the animations. Yeah, Paul does animations, but we're both writing on the scripts. We both work on the characters and such. I currently write episode five. And in turn, he will write episode six. Somewhat, with a little help. With a little help from me. But these kinds of, but this project is rather fun. It takes everything you knew about video games, every single trope and other tropes as well, and does reference a few things from our personal lives, as well as stuff from from well, TV sh TV shows, TV MLP, you know the works. And if we could get pat and if we do manage to get one sneak in before the season before before the season turns dark, we could just slip in a Leave Possibly. Or if you guys are really up for it, if you for all those fan fiction out there, you could basically try to well cross over cross over the a tricky project with an MLP fan fiction you're probably working on. Regardless of what it is. And speaking of that, speaking of crossovers, for those of you who do fellow, for those of you fellows who do Maple Story animation projects, if you want to do something that could, say, coincide alongside our universe, or could fit with it, um, yeah, submit your 
yeah, you basically make your story, cast your actors and all that. But there's a catch. These episodes have to be set between content between certain episodes of, of our shows. That way it's to maintain a sense of continuity and know where we are in each of our seasons if we do these crossover episodes. Mm-hmm. So that's it for now. So this is Lightspeed of Lightspeed Reviews. And Mrs. Book and Dragon. And we both wish you happy gaming. Catch us later.